The Sun Also Rises, 1926, by Ernest Hemingway, follows a group of expatriates as they travel from Paris to Pamplona, Spain, to witness the running of the bulls and the bullfighting festival. Set in the 1920s post-World War I, the novel is considered a cornerstone of modernist literature, often categorized under the lost generation, a term Hemingway popularized to describe the disillusioned youth of the time. The story is narrated by Jake Barnes, an American journalist living in Paris. Jake is in love with Lady Brett Ashley, an independent and promiscuous Englishwoman. However, due to a war wound, Jake is impotent, creating an unresolvable barrier to their romantic relationship. Despite her feelings for Jake, Brett becomes engaged to Mike Campbell, a bankrupt and often drunk Scottish war veteran. The love triangle extends as Robert Cohn, a former college athlete and writer, also falls in love with Brett, leading to conflicts among the men. The novel explores themes of masculinity, sexuality, and existential despair. The group, consisting of Jake, Brett, Mike, Robert, and Bill Gorton, a war veteran and friend of Jake, attends the Festival of San Fermin in Pamplona. The atmosphere becomes tense due to Robert's possessiveness over Brett and her romantic involvement with the matador Pedro Romero. Ultimately, Brett leaves Romero, acknowledging that she cannot sustain a relationship with someone so pure and idealistic. The novel ends with Brett and Jake together in Madrid, where they reflect on what could have been. Themes of Disillusionment and the Lost Generation The characters in The Sun Also Rises represent the lost generation, people disillusioned by World War I. Their search for meaning and identity in a world devoid of traditional values is apparent in their aimless lifestyles. The characters drink excessively, engage in fleeting relationships, and exhibit a sense of discontent, symbolizing a generational crisis. Masculinity and Power Hemingway explores the fragility of masculinity, particularly through the character of Jake, who embodies both strength and vulnerability. Jake's impotence symbolizes the emasculation many soldiers felt after the war. Cohn's idealistic pursuit of Brett and his inability to fit in with the more cynical group further illustrates different aspects of post-war masculinity. Alienation and Isolation Despite traveling together, the characters are emotionally detached from one another. Jake's unrequited love for Brett and the superficiality of Brett's relationships with the men around her reveal their isolation and inability to form meaningful connections. This emotional distance reflects the existential themes running throughout the novel. Escapism and Hedonism The characters seek escape from their inner emptiness through travel, alcohol and romantic entanglements. Their frequent indulgence in drinking and parties represents their desire to distract themselves from their deeper existential struggles. Symbolism of Bullfighting The bullfighting scenes in Pamplona carry significant symbolic weight. The matador Pedro Romero, with his grace and skill, embodies the idea of living life with dignity and passion, something the other characters lack. The bullfights serve as a backdrop for the group's internal struggles, with the ritualistic nature of the sport mirroring the character's own violent, self-destructive tendencies. Style and narrative technique Hemingway's famous iceberg theory, or minimalist style, is evident in The Sun Also Rises. The sparse prose and dialogue-driven narrative leave much unsaid, forcing the reader to infer deeper emotions and meanings. This understated style aligns with the character's inability to articulate their pain and dissatisfaction directly. Conclusion In conclusion, The Sun Also Rises portrays a generation grappling with the aftermath of war, loss and the search for meaning. Through its themes of disillusionment, masculinity and isolation, 
Hemingway captures the essence of a fragmented world, making the novel a powerful exploration of existential despair.